All right, welcome back to Steven Sausage Roll. We have 130 sausages so far, and everything to the left of here, I believe, is completed now. This is where we are roughly where we originally came into this area, so everything left here is completed in this little area. It's like a bay of some kind, and there, there's a lot more on the right, and I believe the final location's on the right. So we're gonna go top down along here is my approach. Drumlin. Last thing, last thing that came to mind for the word Drumlin was Drumlin Diner. I believe that's a location in Fallout 4. So, there's three of them. Kind of in a bit of a trouble there. Uh, yeah, the problem here is that they're stuck against the wall. And, then, and if you do that, they're really stuck against the wall. And if they're stuck against the wall, you're screwed. Because then you can't get them out. So what am I going to do? What am I going to do to fix this? Um... The good news is this this is a uh, two across. Wow. I'm sorry, I just had the realization that I was just playing Necro Dancer a second ago. So I've been just like moving around nonstop for no good reason. I can just stand still, it's fine. <laughs> Necro Dancer, you can never stop moving and it hurts you. Uh so 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 so. The first thing that comes to mind would be stabbing. But then what? I could stab you from here. Now let me take you up the stairs, for example. If that's at all a good reason. If that's a, at all a good idea. But then what? I like try to walk on top of you? Because I could walk on top of you to get over to these guys. Does this help at all? This seems rather unhelpful. Bye! Bye, Fork. I missed you. Alright, um... Don't think that's gonna quite pan out. What if I go for a top, lo a bottom location instead for ro oh, for rolling? Push you right over there, maybe. Oh, that causes me some problems. What if I hook you? Is there any reason this would be helpful? So I'm having a little trouble thinking of it. I could drop you for no reason. That's exciting. <laughs> uh, it gives me the opportunity to put you right. Oh, I was gonna say it gives me the opportunity to put you right there. I guess that's gonna have to work, huh? What? This wouldn't help, though, would it? Yay, I'm stuck in the middle. This served no purpose. How do I... I'm sorry, I'm just- I'm looking at this. I'm trying to think of how I'm gonna get these guys out of there. Because even with this one removed... What do I do with these? How do I deal with the fact that they're stuck? I could stab you. If I stab you, the only way to get you off, though, is I need to actually somehow get this... I need to drop the fork somehow. So do I need to create a system where I can drop the fork? How would I do that if I have to face this direction? Because that's the thing, is they're both against the wall, and they're both in corners where you can't get behind them to push them away from the wall. Once once two of them are out of the way, I can then just go to the side and stab the other one, like, and that one will be fine. But the, the question is how do I get the second one out? Because the... The first one's easy, you just do this, and then you're good to go. Second one's hard, because I could go like... If I get the, if I got rid of this one, for example, I could come up on this side and just go boop, and stab the one on the right, and then just take it out and grill it, and we're done. But getting this one out of here is going to be hard, because I need a way to remove it. Because right now it seems like the only option is to stab it like this, and I don't know how I'd take it off at that point. It, my first guess is that it probably involves dropping my... Being able to drop my weapon? Being able to drop the fork? Is there a reason why I'd want to slide them around? No, I need, a, I need to find a new approach. Whatever we're doing, it has to involve getting you up here. So if, I, if I reverse my direction, I could get a little bit more done. Oh yeah. If I push you over here, we can get you on the right side. That would help. Without having to do weird maneuvers. That didn't help very much. What am I doing? Oh, there we go. That's how I get you. That's how we get you stuck there. So I kind of have. Uh, I have a. It has to involve this. Is the best I can think of right now. What? Oh, you're in the wrong spot. So whatever is going on, I think we have to knock the fork off because I can't see what else we, this would involve. Everything we do in, in this in this. Uh, World seems to involve knocking forks off right now. 
But what would I do? Um... Do I push the fork around? Oh, shit. I think I got it. So the, the fork just needs to be pushed into a sausage. Oh god, is this really gonna work? Um... What? Alright, we'll see what happens. I think... I think I can just push you in. Oh my... God. <laughs> How would you... Uh, fine. Okay. You are relying on some logical leaps here that are impressive, but horrifying at the same time. Okay. And now, we need to get you out of there. So, I'm going to now stab you, and you're not going to like it, but that's fine, because I'm not really much of a pleaser. Okay, so... You're cooked. And... Uh, how do I get you off of my character? I guess I'll have to take that up there. Let's put you back down here for now. Oops. I'll put you back for now. But stop grabbing back onto it. Alright. I'm gonna have to let it go of it right up here. Oh, I'm gonna have to push you off first. Dear lord. Alright. This game's breaking my brain again. So this is a new mechanic I need to think about now. Is the idea that my fork can stab without me being the one holding it at the moment. It can just do that. Oh no. Can I not take you upstairs? Oh, that works. Interesting. Thought, what, thought I was in trouble there. I was like, oh crap, I should have not gotten rid of everything, so now I can't get you to do what I need you to do. Because we need to stab you here. What am I doing? You're already, you're already not attached. I have nothing else I have to do. I'm sorry, let's rewind a little bit. My stupid brain forgot what we're doing here. I don't need to get you up top there anymore when I've already gotten you here. Ta-da! Jesus, okay. That involved me taking a bit of a logical leap there, but yes. Fork being moved into sausage makes it stab sausage, regardless of whether you're holding it. You can use sausage to stab other sausage with fork sausage and forky stuff. Uh, wow, I can't even walk up to that one from here. Alright. This one's gonna be a pain, because it's got these pillars everywhere. The nasty pillars that like to stop me from moving around properly. It's case in point. Uh, so I'm sure it's gonna involve knocking the fork off again. I can't even get a, I can't even get around right now in these directions with the, with the, the fact that the fork's attached. Yeah, I can only move upwards from here, really. So around here, can't do that from here. Let's go backwards. Howdy. I'm gonna go ahead and drop you off because I'm pretty sure that's what I have to do now. And oh, you're off the edge. So I need to get the fork over there. Unless I can get the fork over there, we're in trouble. So... Now you're on the ground. That might be bad for me. Where else would I want it to be, though? I guess we'll just knock it down and see if I can do anything with that. Right now, if I just push that that way, we win. Ta-da! But that might not work for me. If I touch this thing from the top, we get cooked. That's also a problem. Cooked, what am I saying? If we touch it from the top, then we'll grab it, which is a problem right now. Face it backwards, God damn it! Stupid brain. That's all I had to do. All I have to do is not face it when I touch it. How did I forget that? Okay. There we go. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. There's no puzzle here, practically. It was so easy. I got stuck for that long? Uh-oh. Might be a little stuck. How do I get- how do I grab the fork when I'm over here? I'm gonna wanna put it somewhere else, I think. Yep! Alright, um... Shit. I push you down here. I can then push you sideways, because I need to be able to grab it from above, so it has to be pushed in one of those directions over there. 
Um, if I go over here, I can get some maneuverability, which will allow me to push it the other direction. Over here, away from the walls. There we go. There we go. I think that's the puzzle solved now, more or less. I felt really stuck for a second there. Oh, gonna have to turn you around, but they gave me space for that. That's not part of the puzzle. We're, cl we're clear, right? Oh no. I have no escape. I have no mouth yet, I must scream. Um. I'm gonna push you on there. We're gonna walk you across, and now I can't get off. Oh no. Okay, so. I need an escape direction. How would I escape? Because I think I have to walk across like this. My exit's down there, so I have to be able to get there. So where do I position... I see it. I see it. I see it. Okay, so... We need to position the sausage. So that's it's just gonna block the direction I'm going in. It needs to be, like, right here. If it's right here, then I can walk across it. How do I do that? How do I do that? It has to be right here. How do I push it in that direction? Um... Oh, I don't have to. I can push it further than that. And then push it here. And now it'll be in the path. And now when I roll over, it'll arrive here. We're good. We're good. There we go. So now that it's sticking out, it's not in position yet, but when I roll the other meat over, it's going to then be pushed in the right position. And then we're good. I believe I've solved it. I've just got to not mess up these steps here. Alright, running all the way around. Going to go grab it. Didn't go to our rotational pier. Please be solved. I think I've got this. I think I've got this. Come on. Oh. I didn't think about that. You can only walk off the end points, so I can't I can't escape from here. Ah, I messed up how sausage movement works. So that sausage needs to be there for me to escape. But for me to just get off this sausage, I need to... Oh... Okay... The sausage needs to be up there. It needs to be right here. This is the sausage location. If the, saus ow, if the sausage goes here... With the, uh, the way that thing leans, I can then walk onto this, and then I can roll it back over here and walk onto that. That's what I messed up. Here comes the big test. You push it on. Walk... Oh! Walk... Then we climb aboard this sausage. Walk. Get off said sausage. Climb down. Push you out of the way. Grill you. And we're out of here. Got it. Now what next? How many are left? How are we doing on... 135. We've only gotten five this episode? There's one up here. There's one over here. And there's one down- oh, last three. Last three of this world. Let's see if they- let's see how hard they kick me in the teeth. It's getting surprisingly hard just to navigate the, the uh, map at times. There we go. Terry Ridge! Um, so obviously, this little thing's easy. Which, of course, means it's not easy. But obviously this is cookable like that. But we won't be doing that. Let's see. I need to get over there. To the other one. Yep. K. 
can't push it from the side, so I have to somehow get on the other side of it. Which means I have to get my fork off to get there. So... I need to stab you. So we can fall in that direction. Let's go ahead and get to that part. Hello. Just gonna go ahead and drop drop my fork now. Bye, Forky. Oh. Hang on a second. Gotta be able to stand on that platform, so we need to push you down one. Gotcha. Uh, go ahead. Good to go. Except for the part where I'm stuck. We can just push you one more over, over though. There we go. And we push you over here. Maybe one further back. Yeah. I think that's all we needed. Are we, so did we... Did I solve it already? Is that the whole puzzle? That might be the whole puzzle. Careful not to push you in the water. Gotta be able to retrieve you carefully. Easily. Oh, no. Oh, no, we're good. We're good. I just had the moment of realization that I can't push it forward because it'll fall in the ravine, but we just put the sausage there and we'll be fine. Oops. Get out of here. Now the other one's stuck. Surely I can just pry it off on something though, right? Surely? Don't call me Shirley. Um. So you're cooked. And you. I just take over here. And I believe we're cooked too. What? This was one of those weirdly easy ones that happens every now and then. I suppose that because it's built in a non-linear fashion, there's some that they that are meant to build on the mechanics of others. So once you so once you solve some of the harder ones, some of the easier ones might just be really quick solutions. Who knows? Well, the developer probably does. Just a hunch. Uh, baby rock. Oh man. Why is it called baby rock? What am I gonna do here? First thing that comes to mind is that I could totally push these towards that grill. Like that. Okay, maybe not quite. There's a double water over there, so I wouldn't be able to repeat that, would I? Unless I pushed you further up. So here's my obvious solution, is just walking across that. So the question is going to be, why does this not work? Because I'm sure it doesn't. Oh no, I can't walk in that direction. <laughs> no, no, I can't walk over there. No. Alright, let's reset. So, I need to... I need to knock my, my fork off. My bad. We have a ladder up here. Up to Daisy. So, if I stab you, I can take one of you up here. Or both, maybe. Both likely. Got to stab you from this side. At which point I can't get through. Maybe if I push you guys both to the side, we'll have a little more space for me to do my illicit activities. But... How does this work out for me? How does this work out for me? See, it feels like we're in the wrong position. Oh, wait. I push you down. Oops. Push you down here. I can knock you off. And then I can just come stab you from the other direction. And that's how we change what side you're on. Ta-da! Now you live here. And now I can walk on top of you. And I can make these two uh, sausages on top of each other. And I don't know if that part's good or not, but we'll do it anyway. Shit. Shit. Nothing went according to plan. It's all a horrible tragedy. Um... Crap. I mean, I could go push- I could move the other one. 
I'm sure. Is that good for me altogether? Wait, I need to wait, 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 wait. I need to put you in the hard to reach position over there. Because I'm not going to have my fork anymore if I do this. So we need to put you up top. In the other position. There we go. Because this one, I, this one I, I'm going to have to roll without my fork. There we go. Oh. Didn't think about how I was going to get off this, did I? So you need to be right here. I'm going to get off. Um, wait, maybe over there? Is that good? Is that a good idea? That might be the plan. Okay, fine. We'll test that. Oops. Knock you over here. Knock you down. That that's level with the floor right there. So now we can just go stand on that. And I'm on foot. Huzzah, as it goes. And then I can push you into the, the slot down here. And I can be generally displeased with you or something. Um, ah, fork. Die. Um... What do I do about this? Why is there a beam up here is the question. So maybe I'm not supposed maybe I'm supposed to stab one of them. Why would I stab one of them is the question. And how would I get it up here? How would I get it up here if I stabbed one of them? That's concerning. Seems improbable. But I do need a return trip or I'm not gonna get anywhere. How do I move these guys and then come back? What am I going to do here? I'm feeling a little stuck now. I think I've reached a dead end on this logic. So I've been fooling around for a while and I just found this weird trick. Is that if you push it, look at this. You can stab it into the sausage and you can knock it off. And you'll catch it while you're rolling it. That's a big deal. So I'm going to roll around. So I'm turning around. I'm backed into it. I'm going to try pushing these across. There we go, right? My fork is now past the gate. I can now walk through here like it's no big deal with no fork. And he'll catch the fork, which is all I needed. And that's why there's a pillar on the top corner. Because with this... P shit. With this pillar on the top corner, suddenly you can do that. It's like, we're actually set. That's it. That's all I needed. It's, an, it's, just, it's another new trick. God damn it. <laughs> this world has so many new tricks in it, and it's exhausting. It's amazing, but it's exhausting. There we go. There we go, everyone. Goddamn victory. Dun, dun, dun. Well, that didn't seem like it was supposed to happen. What? Oh, weird. Solving that puzzle gave me a sausage. But this one also has a sausage. Wait, what happens if I put you in here? What? Is going on? The sausage unlocked early. And I can put it in the other puzzle. What in the world? That's insane. We mourn not the dead, but the knowledge that left the world with them. What's going on here? Is that the next world? There's a grill over there. Is that where I need to go? Wait a minute, there's a hook. Hang on a second, that's shaped like a hook. Can I use that? If I can position a sausage to be in here before we start, what happens if I hook it? They're making me think outside the puzzle already. Now the hook is staying there. Is that good? Oh, it sinks the moment I do that. 
I could probably use that, though. Now it's sticking through. Can I stab you to go on? That was a weird moment for me. Okay. Um. What happened there? Can I use that to my advantage? Was there a reason to do that? Let's go back. Keep you in there. That's gotta be good in some way, right? What if we push you past? I could th then now I have a now I have a stopping point. Now I can, now I can stab you, right? So, shit. It's shaped the wrong way. No, not quite. I can do this. That's not gonna help, is it? Why did I think that was going to help? Um, can I raise it higher somehow? Would I, why, would I want to? It's actually a physics object you can touch. How weird is that? Wait a minute. I'm not entirely sure what I'm accomplishing here, but I moved it. Which is a weird concept in its own right. What if I stabbed it from the other, the other end instead? Going back, come on. Um, let's try stabbing it from the other side. What am I doing though? What am I accomplishing? I'm just not sure what I'm doing right now, like, what the- What are these actions worth? What am I accomplishing? I think I can walk you around here. Whoa. Is that good? Do I want that to happen? Where's the grill? What is going on? That's not a grill, is it? It's like... It's like... It's stone. What is puzzle right now? That just makes it fall. What do I do with this? It's just stone. Is there there's a there's a grill over there? What if I can... I can't move it around outside the puzzle. What am I doing? What am I... What level of insanity is happening right now? Hang on. I can stab it through. Oh my god. This thing's attached to everything, right? It's like, can I climb the le- <laughs> Oh, What the f fuck What the fuck ever? Oh. What do I do with that? Besides that, that was not the right thing to do, obviously, but... What in the world? I want... I guess I want to latch onto the existing world. That makes sense, right? Right? <laughs> I gotta cling to my sanity a little bit. So, like, if I... Uh, if I could push just one more over. How do I... If I could get to attached to this tower, we're good. What the hell? There's underwater... It's like a... Oh my god. I just realized that this is like one of those... It's like when you're at a fast food restaurant, they have the little like... They have like... I don't know what it's called. Like the, the cage thing that they cook the fries in and the grease. 
Like that, I just pulled one of those out of, the, out of the ground, basically, is what happened. The question is, how do I push it over? Is there a way to stop it from going down like that? Long enough for me to push it further over. My current problem is I don't currently have a way... ...to make it go... ...this way. Without dropping it. I want to... I want to... I want to get, get it stuck on top of this ladder if I can. I'm also curious about why they have a ladder over there. Maybe I should push it? That probably helped. Although I'd push that sausage too far over and I think I might get in some trouble for that. So let's... ...try to bring that back in. So we push you over. Let's get you out of here real quick. Um, what am I going to do with you? What am I going to do with you? Um, we can push this guy down. So right now we still have a problem where I can't get it to push from left to right. I can push it further to the right, which is a bad idea. Can I climb the ladder safely? Yes. What's this thing? It's all counted as one solid object. No tricks here. Got no way to make this whole thing go left to right. I can't see any conceivable way I'd get over there either, so... I think it probably needs to stay where it is right now. I could probably push it up one. It has a spot for me to let go of objects, so... I probably want to cook them by grabbing them from, oops, from over here. Good. Good. Problem. Now it's cooked, but how do I get it off? Oh, my brain's melting. How is this the real? How is this a real level? Um. Uh, how do I get it back? I guess. Oh my goodness! I can move the entire thing. Oh my god. That was not the right call. <laughs> Crap. Um. If you're right there, you can catch it. Probably a start. I probably need you to push this thing back up though, real quick. And then we can come back around. And then push you in the way to catch it. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to knock it off. It's the only way we can proceed. Got it. Oh jeez. Okay, so we're doing it. We're doing it. My brain is going to start leaking out of my ears any moment now. I did not think we were gonna have large object manipulation as a core component all of a sudden, but it sure seems like we do. Um, where was I stabbing it again? From the other side. So up here. Gonna want to stab you from over here. Bring you up. Oh, sorry. Forgot to move the whole thing again. You know, that thing that we can suddenly do. Just move and move and move entire parts of the level around. Oh jeez. So this So this game's getting ready to lose its mind, isn't it? Like in a moment here? When this starts becoming a regular thing, and the game just shits itself, and I and Oh man. We're gonna be in for some tough levels then. Fine, it's fine. It's cool. My I can totally take it. I won't go crazy. Even a little. Ta-da! Man. 
Man! That's a thing that happens now. That's a thing that happens now. It's still here. What do I even do about that? It's still here. I can like... No, I can't. I was gonna push it around. Is it stuck here forever? Yes, it is. That's also weird in its own different way. What the... F Ugh. At the beginning of time, all the sausages were joined together in a never-ending chain. Okay, that got way weirder. That could, the... <laughs> We mourn not the dead, but and, and, but knowledge that left the world with them. Oh my god, is this... I think that description's hinting at the fact that, like, that is separated from us and we can't access it, and that there's secrets underground, and... This, these messages are getting weirder. At the beginning of the time, all sausages were joined together in a never-ending chain. Whoa. It's like a mausoleum? There's a sausage. You guys. This is a thing now. This is part of our lives. I'm just gonna start puzzles, and there's just gonna be a sausage that I take with me into the puzzle. That's, that, that, that's, 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 that's here now. It's part of the game. What the hell? Like, that's just normal now. That's... Alright, well, thanks for watching, like always, guys. I'll see you next time. And I think this is going to get a lot harder. Like, really fast. If this is going to be a thing that happens all the time now. Ha <laughs> ha